Hi guys, back again with another video. Now this time it's going to be a Q&A video again. Uh, so I've been getting a few questions regarding the Apple Watch Wi-Fi issue. So a lot of people have Apple Watch. Uh, some of them don't even know that the Apple Watch has uh, built-in Wi-Fi. So it can connect to your home network and uh, use that network to communicate instead of your phone. So your phone can be kept outside, uh, kept uh, switched off or whatever. And this will work uh, standalone. So um if you want to know more about what is the difference between this one and the gsm one uh, then i'll be making a video on that later on uh, but this video is to resolve the issue of wi-fi so a lot of people have lost the wi-fi from their phone so when they disconnect the uh, watch from the phone the watch is not getting connected so i'll be showing that in the video so let's go ahead and uh, see the fix it's a pretty simple fix but a lot of people are struggling with it so that's why i'm making this video so go ahead see the video how to fix the apple watch wi-fi issue okay so let's go ahead and fix the wi-fi issue on the apple watch now let me just show you uh, what the problem is so right now you'll see this phone icon over here hopefully you can see that that green color phone icon that means that it's connected with bluetooth with the phone now let me switch off the bluetooth i switch it off now as soon as i switch it off from here the connection will go off show you again Okay, take some time for this to register. Okay, done. So now you see that red icon, uh, red phone icon with a slash between. So that idly should turn into a Wi-Fi icon. So, so how to fix it? So let's go ahead, go into settings, go into Wi-Fi. Now in Wi-Fi, you'll see all the other Wi-Fi is uh, around you. Go ahead and forget the networks. Okay. Okay, so there was only one which was registered, this one. Now, register it again. Now, I'll put in the password. Okay, so I put in the password. Now, I've signed in. Okay, that's done. Now, all you have to do is go into Bluetooth again, switch it on. Now, it should automatically connect to your Apple Watch. So, it's connected. Now, Let's put the Apple Watch on charging. Now, when the Apple Watch is put on charging, that's when it generally takes all the updates like music and any update that has been put on the phone that takes, uh, the Apple Watch takes it then. Uh, just for the heck of it, we'll just put the app, uh, iPhone also on charging. Okay, it's 99% charged anyways. Okay, so now let's go ahead and put off the Bluetooth. Now you see, now you see the Wi-Fi icon come up. So now it's working. Now you don't really need your phone to be on the same Wi-Fi or anything. Uh, that's why I like this option. Okay, so that's it. Uh, it's done. Now you see the Wi-Fi is working. You can see the Wi-Fi icon. Uh, I am not connected on Wi-Fi or Bluetooth over here. Both are off. Now my watch is standalone. It's working with the Wi-Fi network at home. Uh, now it's a simple fix. I'll just repeat the steps again. Uh, on the phone, go to the Wi-Fi network that was registered, your home network. Uh, forget that network, remove it from your list and then re-register it again. Once it's re-registered, put the Apple Watch on uh, the charger so that uh, it starts taking the settings from the phone and leave it there uh, with the Bluetooth on, put the Bluetooth on, connect the watch, uh, let it transfer the settings after 5-10 minutes, then go ahead and uh, switch off the Bluetooth and Wi-Fi and this should be working. Now you see it's working fine. So I'll uh, get all the notifications directly on my watch. I do not have to carry my phone in the house. Yes, if I go outside the house, uh, this will not work. Uh, yes, if you are roaming around with the GeoFi device in your pocket, then this will be standalone. So you can use it uh, with the GeoFi's internet and this one with a different internet. So that way is also it will work. If you want to know more about that, just comment and I'll explain that also to you. So that's it for this video. If you like the video, please subscribe with the like button and do comment and I'll see you again with another video. Bye-bye.